sing a song. Yes? This is the boldest UFC fighter. Look at the behavior he allows himself. He grabs fighters by the back of the neck, yells at them, refuses to shake hands, and intimidates everyone before the fight. He even dismisses the universally respected Glover Teixeira. And then he met Magomed Ankalaev, who was not going to tolerate such behavior. A scuffle in the octagon nearly ended in scandal. Kutalaba tried to trick the Dagestani by pretending he was seriously hit during the first exchange. But the problem was that not only did Ankalaev believe it and rush to finish him off, but the referee also refused it and decided to stop the fight. The Mongolian was furious and demanded a rematch right there and then. A year later, he died, but the man was rushed and talked of bully respect. After falling to a knockdown, the cocky fighter asked for more. This is the boldest UFC fighter. Look at the behavior he allows himself. He grabs fighters by the back of the neck, yells at them, refuses to shake hands, and intimidates everyone before the fight. He even dismisses the universally respected Glover Teixeira. And then he met Magomed Ankalaev, who was not going to tolerate such behavior. A scuffle in the octagon nearly ended in scandal. Kutalaba tried to trick the Dagestani by pretending he was seriously hit during the first exchange. But the problem was that not only did Ankalaev believe it and rush to finish him off, but the referee also believed it and decided to stop the fight. Sí. Estoy the Moldovan was furious no, and demanded a rematch right there and then. No, a year respect. later he got it, yeah. but the modest Russian taught the bully respect. After falling to a knockdown, the cocky fighter asked for more. Social media, so I was definitely, definitely 
This guy shows he's an absolute professional with this machine. Huh? He's using it to clean the grill and wrap up the road, but it's not just his precision. Yeah. It's also a gift to John Dunn with essentially no ways to clean it. He then works on perfectly clean up the ditch. But the best part is that he didn't shut down the road for three okay. years just to get this done. This guy shows he's an... This girl takes an angle grinder to a car and writes her signature. Why must they think she can ruin the car? But it will make her look perfect every time. And when she's done, it looks much better than you expect. She's also a mechanic and has become famous after posting videos of her work across social media. Would you let her sign your car? This girl takes an angle grinder to a car and writes her signature. Why must they think she can ruin the car? But it will make her look perfect every time. And when she's done, it looks much better than you expect. She's also a mechanic and has become famous after posting videos of her work across the country. Would you ever find her car? This is bamboo drifting, which is very popular in China. Because the people there do not use boats to cross the river, but use hollow thick bamboo, which can easily lift a load of 150 kilograms. The special thing about it is that not everyone can do it. Rather, one has to practice for years to learn it, because it is very difficult to balance on this bamboo branch. And once they learn it, they can cover a journey of hours in minutes. This is bamboo. This guy has an entire frog army in its wild. This may even be the kid who accidentally breeded 1.4 million of them in his backyard, which caused his neighbors to move. The frogs all started hopping over to him and looked directly at him, with a lot of people saying that this looks like their worst nightmare. This guy has an entire frog army. <laughs> Yeah, that's a 10 monsters. Oh, 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 oh,
man, Matt Butcher, was on one of these dives and was feeding a mole when it grabbed onto his thumb. So you see, all it wanted was the hot dog that looked like the thumb. And then, pop, that second jaw comes up and rips his thumb off. Now he has a toe for a thumb. Well, his own. This is a more eight. So you think the Earth is rotating a thousand miles per hour? That's why the sun comes up? No, I think the Earth rotates at 15 degrees per hour. That's why the sun comes up. Looks like it's coming up. But if we zoom in, you can see it's already up. There's just too much atmosphere that is making it lens, so it's blowing it up. Ah, you see, the problem there is when you actually place photos and images of the sun as it's rising with a solar filter, then you can see it being cut off by the horizon. So then you get the sun actually is going further away, and the lensing from the atmosphere is blowing it up. Maybe you don't see the because the sun's angular size does not change as it rises or sets. And that's what happens when you come in the American We can't say that the atmosphere is running up. Because you've got that pretty quickly that the sun rises and sets and with solar filters and the angular size remains the same. Dear one, dear one. So you think the Earth is going to be just a pair of speed snakes to their cameras? It might sound strange. The Earth makes so much that it's punishment. But the truth is, movie bloopers that made the final cut, the Lord of the Rings, Vico Morton, and the Aragorn versus Poe while filming a scene where he had to take it home. One of the biggest fans and hustles in Las Vegas, Jordan Morton, Rose. Oh, yeah, you are right. 
Israel is 3,000 years old, 75 years now. And this is not coming from a Jew, but from a proud Muslim. The prophets of God whom I believe in were Israelites. A significant number of these prophets disseminated their teachings in the land of Canaan. A land which Joshua B. Nun later renamed Israel. And then he came to the Jerusalem as the nation's capital. Yes, Mia, it wasn't all Jim Trump, it was King David. He was Jesus of Nazareth, Mia. Homeland, Israel. The Roman Emperor Hadrian expelled Jews from Israel, erasing the name Judea. He supplanted it with the Roman Latin term Syria Palestina, which evolved into Palestine. Similarly, the city of Shen was changed to Neapolis, or Nablus, which means in Roman Latin, new city or new place. The Jewish people knew Israel has only been a state since 1948. Okay. <laughs> 